Hey, what's up, guys? It's Lo here from Nino and Lo, and I'm coming to you talking today all about my Rex Begonia. I have totally destroyed this plant. So in this video, you can help me figure out why, because I am by no means an expert on Rex Begonias. So let's get into the video, guys. Quick tips about Rex Begonia care. They definitely prefer bright, indirect light. They love to be kept moist, but definitely not waterlogged. They thrive in a high humidity environment. They like a well-draining soil mix, and they prefer to be fertilized once a month during their growing season. Now this is how the plant looked when I first got it about a year ago. So fast forward to present day, and this is what it looks like now. So I have this begonia that was a lot bushier and leafed out a lot better. And I think it's kind of looking like this because, well, first of all, it's dry, but I think it needs a little bit more space. I think it needs a little dividing in here. So I'm going to try to take a few pieces out. I've already taken this little piece out and we'll see how that does. I'm going to try and carefully get some more and see how this goes. All right, let's see. Now I think I can just pull it apart. Oh yeah. And just get it in a few sections here. Well, that's perfect. And this wants to come apart here as well. Yeah. So I got three clumps that I can now pot up. Perfect. I'm by no means an expert on Rex begonias. This is my first one that I've had for this long. I've had it now for about a year. And I know that they don't like bright, direct sunlight. So I've had it in indirect sunlight but it's still lost all that vibrant color. So that's kind of telling me maybe I haven't been giving it enough of a sunlight. I have been keeping a tray with some rocks, um, with some water, with some rocks in it to try to increase the humidity under the plant, but I don't think that's been enough. Now I've also read that Rex begonia is kind of going to a dormant phase. So maybe that's why the plant is kind of going dormant because it's the winter season but we'll see how it goes so if we're not yet garden friends feel free to subscribe and if any of you have any tips for me about rex begonias please drop them in the comments below and don't forget to give me a thumbs up so this is what i ended up with guys four plants bit leggy but hopefully now they can start to produce some new shoots. They have a little bit more room. Um, I'll keep you updated on how they go because these begonia plants, these are Rex begonias. They're not the easiest, but I love the leaves. So at least I haven't killed it yet. <laughs> 